Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a kind of beach theme collab. I'm doing this with Sabrina XO and ALH Sanders, which is Sabrina and Ashley. I love them to death. Their videos are always amazing and they're super gorgeous. I will have both of their videos linked right here the entire time of mine. Um, whenever we all put up our videos, I will make sure to link both of them right here for the full length of this video. Um, I did the hair in an outfit. Everybody did an outfit. I'm pretty sure, yeah. So everybody did an outfit. Sabrina did the makeup and an outfit and then Ashley is doing a what's in my beach bag or what she kind of keeps in her beach bag um, and an outfit at the end as well. So if you are interested in seeing how I got this hair and what exactly I am wearing, then just keep watching. And don't forget to go check out my girls. I love them to death. And I know you guys will absolutely love their videos. So don't forget to go subscribe to them and I will see you all in the next video. Bye. So what you're going to need is anything that's going to create waves. I love the Giddy Heat Wave Creator. And I'm taking two dry shampoos, one from Bioterra and one from Redken. Also, you will need this Redken um, Wax Blast Tin or whatever kind of spray you want. And then I'm also taking the Got To Be Guardian Angel Heat Protectant and two body ponies. So I'm taking this Redken Powder Fresh and I'm going to spray this all over my roots. I have really oily hair so I like to combine two. Don't ask me why, I just do. Um, but the Bioterra one is really great by itself as well, but I just really like to the Redken one also. And you can find the Bioterra one at your local Sally's for I think about $10. And my hair is actually second day um, hair and it was pinned straight the night before. So that's what I'm working with. So you want to rub it all in and you want to kind of get any spots that you miss. I love this stuff. It's so, 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 so good. And then you're just going to want to brush out your hair to get any excess that might be going around out that made no sense, huh? Then I'm going to spray the heat protectant all over my hair. And I'm going to take this clip. I'm going to leave this front section right around my face down. And I'm going to clip the rest of the hair back. It'll just make it a lot easier when we start braiding. And I'm not the best braider, but I try my best. Um, so I'm just going to start from the top and create one full braid. And then start adding pieces as I go down. Um, I don't know, this sounds dumb, but I guess they call this like the French braid. I've never done a French braid or anything like that, but I really like the way this braid looks. It just kind of adds something extra to the really simple beach waves we'll be doing. And this hairstyle and what I'm wearing in this video is definitely what I would wear um, to the beach. Definitely. <laughs> so I'm going to stop about there and I'm going to look and see where I want to place it. Then we put the rest of the hair back and do the bobby pins and I place these in an X. So they're going to stay all day long. Now we're going to kind of tug it and loosen it just a little bit. I'm going to take the Goody Wave Creator and I'm going to start taking sections of my hair. These are actually fairly large sections. Um, this is just a really simple look to do. It took me about 10 minutes to curl uh, the hair. But I just, you don't want it to look perfect. This is just a wavy beach look. It's nothing that's supposed to be uniformed and really nice looking. <laughs> so again, I am taking very, very large sections and you just want to do this all over your hair. And I kind of went with this hairstyle in this outfit because I like simple stuff and if I'm at the beach, this is what I would do. Something simple, quick, and easy. I just, I love it. So nice. So I'm just going to kind of touch up any spots and also run my fingers through my hair. And I'm going to take this Wax Blast Tin from Redken. I love this stuff. It kind of acts as a hairspray, but it really helps kind of mesh some curls together and it just... I don't know, it looks really, really great. I don't use any hairspray in this video. The Wax Blast is the only finishing spray that I do use. So this is what this side looks like. Then you're just going to do the same exact thing on the other side, taking pretty large sections and curling them around the wave creator. I also have 
a summer hair tutorial that doesn't require as much heat, um, I will link that somewhere in this video. And you can also do what I did in that video the night before and then just do the rest of this to your hair. So I'm going to spray the Redken Wax Blast all over my hair again. And this is what it looks like. So let's get on to the outfit. I'm wearing a romper from Belk. I absolutely love it. It's so easy just to throw on and go. Really cute and bright. So it just kind of has this ruffle and an elastic band at the waist. If you want, you could totally add a belt, but I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I don't know. So I'm going to take these uh, Charlotte Blue sandals. I love them. Super plain, but really cute. And that's what it looks like. Also, I have these sunglasses. They're from Target. And yeah, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye.